five dollars? Yeah. They grow, they grow them here and everything's local and they don't spray nothing, so that's always possible. Okay, cool. Nice. I would like to get two, I guess. You want to get two, they can pick on you two. You yeah. Want. Um, that one. That one. And the one next to it. Onion for the fish tonight. And you want tomato? Sure. $12 even, how's that? $12 even. Oh, I like this girl already. She got chains. Chains for strawberry, man. There you go. <laughs> it's not strawberry season, I guess, right? Yeah, it is. Our strawberries being here another two and a half weeks. Oh, okay. The good ones are right now are way too big. They need a little cold snap to get a little flavor. Okay. All right. Awesome. This is that. Do you go, Pop? Awesome, man. Thank you. Okay. All right, we're inside, we're inside of Route 60. If you see, stop by this produce place. Pretty good. Pretty good. Always vote America. Oh, and always vote American. Always vote American. There you go. Sounds good. Thank you. <laughs> Have a great day. Today we're driving across the state from the Old Salt King of the Beach tournament and it's a long drive across the state so we figured while we're doing nothing in the car it's time to read mean comments. All right, first for a little disclaimer. These comments, we're not upset by them. We know and I want all the young youngsters out there to know and everyone to know that when someone makes a mean comment to you that's about them, that they're insecure and jealous of you or they want to date you or, or something. It's not you, it's them. So everyone remember that. Um, so this is just amusing and we're going to get right to the comments. I'm driving, so don't worry guys. I'm going to read some comments, but both my hands are on the wheel. Alright, so the first comment is regarding one of my bass fishing videos. Oh my gosh! Look at that fish! And this comment is from Fish CT, and he said, LOL, you have no idea what you're doing. Alright. <laughs> Two points. One is, we, ne we never claim to know what we're doing, all right? We're out there fishing, just like you, and we're doing the best we can, and we, and we do go fishing a lot, and with some other great people, so everything we know, we learn from somebody else. We're not saying that Darcy is a professional bass angler, like Scott Martin, or that she has been fishing for 30 years, or that I've been, well, I've been fishing for 30, maybe 30 years, but, so that's number one. Number two is, you know, if you're, fish, if you're a real fisherman, you know that when you go to a new area, or you're trying something different, you're not going to know what you're doing. Um, and also, if you're not from that area, you're not going to know what that person's doing. So, I mean, we pre everyone loves feedback and, and trying different things, but, you know, trying something on my water in Florida is not going to be the same thing that someone's going to try in Michigan trying to catch a bass. It just, that just doesn't work out. But, but thanks for the comment. All right, next comment. This is from one of our videos. Uh, it was pretty long ago. It was one of our first videos where we didn't catch anything, but we decided to put the video up anyway, and we had passed, 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 passed. We had gone past... Donald Trump's Mar-a-Lago home. Not a political endorsement. But anyway, this fellow wrote, this is Silverbit69. Uh, you know, you can only tell that the name is gonna be a precursor. You should be ashamed of yourself for posting a mislead forward slash fake video that claimed to be with Donald Trump. Three exclamation points on that. Your page should also be shut down and sued by Donald himself. Bad, bad, bad. All exclamation points in capitals. Go to your room. I hope your business now sinks. So again, the name of the title says Donald Trump's Mar-a-Lago home and ran over a rope vlog. It does not say we were with Donald Trump. I mean, we were never with him, so he's misleading already. He's incorrect. Um, and we just said it's not a political endorsement and we just happened to drive by his house, so we put that in the thumbnail, in the, in the title, I'm sorry. But um, no, I'm not gonna go to my room and no, my business is not sinking, it's actually growing. So thanks, thanks for the comment. This one is a comment I received on Instagram, and this is from Saint underscore George 3 and he said the following, disappointed you'd reduce a sport we're all passionate about to cheap sex appeal. I would like to take this opportunity to apologize to every fisherman everywhere that Darcy's bikini has reduced the sport you're so passionate about. All right, this one's on our Halloween Donald Trump, Hillary Clinton video, you know, the funny one with the costumes, and it's from Randomness. He says, that was the dumbest video I've ever watched. Well, you know randomness. It probably is the dumbest video we ever did make. But that's okay. We were just having fun. And uh, we thought, you know, Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump was a great idea. And we had a blast making it. And you're the only one so far in the comment section who thinks it's the dumbest video ever. But thanks for watching the whole thing and giving us a view. On one of our YouTube uh, gator hunting videos, Jake DeSulio writes, You're going straight to hell. I can't believe you would do that to an innocent gator. I hate you ugly pieces of redneck Well Jake, let me just tell you what I did this week. For starters, I've had some turkey sandwiches, I've had crab cakes, I've had ham, 
I've also had eggs and bacon this week. And then for my fishing, I've actually killed a bunch of fish this week too. I killed a few kingfish, some bonitas, some Spanish mackerel, a redfish, and a gag grouper. So how do you like this ugly redneck now? Okay, this comment I received on Instagram, and this comment is from Tim Page underscore, two underscores. And he said, it's amazing how women can sexualize anything, even fishing. I just don't get why you have to sexualize something to get places. Nice arse though. Hey Tim, <laughs> Tim Page. You don't get how women can sexualize anything. Let me tell you something, buddy. <laughs> it's not the women, it's the men. She's just wearing a bikini like girls in Florida do wherever she goes. It's the advertising in the car industry, the music industry, uh, the entertainment industry, the movie industry, every single industry, okay? Um, that's just marketing and advertising 101. We are finally back home. I'm super happy to be home. We had a long trip. I was very busy the whole time, and now I've just got a ton more stuff to do here at the house. I have a bunch of schoolwork to do this week, as well as I need to ship out all of the calendars that everybody ordered. Thank you very much for your support in ordering calendar calendars, but just want to let you know that's going to be taken care of next, this week, as well as the anchor bracelets that I'm selling as well on my website. And you can check that out in the description below. And Brian is going to mention something real quick. Oh. <laughs> hey guys, I just want to mention, and, and we get a lot of questions, and a lot of the answers are in the description below the videos. You know, down there we have all our sponsor information, reels and rods and clothes and tackles and shoes and everything else. Uh, also down there is uh, how to support our sizzle if you want. You're again through the calendar she mentions, the bracelets, becoming a Patreon, again exclusive content, and also of course that Amazon link that you can uh, gateway that you can use to buy anything you want on Amazon. And Darcy gets a couple pennies from it. And uh, no, no harm, no foul to you. It's just the same. And uh, of course, she also has a PO box there. Do you want to send uh, yes. any any mail? She'd love to get mail. She hasn't got any mail yet. Remember? Yeah. Uh, so you can be the first one to send her mail. Yeah. Uh, so that's all great. And lastly, uh, in a video recently, uh, Darcy's fault for saying it. Uh, she said the God with the D word um, after it. And my 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 fault mainly. I usually edit those things out. I I, I missed it. And so a couple people mentioned that that's a bad word, and we know it is. And my, like, like Chuck, one of our great viewers, said that, and some other folks, and I, I apologize. Uh, my fault for not, well, her fault for saying it, yeah. my fault for the final, you know, I, my, I had the final, you know, responsibility on that, and I apologize. And uh, I took the sizzle. Yeah, and actually it is my fault, it's not his fault. Um, I shouldn't have said that word to begin with, so I apologize. I usually don't know, normally use those words, and I apologize. Um, anyways, so we have a busy week ahead of us. We're going to be doing some fishing this week. I'm not exactly sure what yet, but we'll figure it out. Um, <laughs> well, I'll go a couple of things. We're going to a seminar, I think, uh, yeah. tomorrow night. And then we're going to definitely do some bass fishing, some inshore fishing. It's windy as hell out. Well, yes. Excuse me, windy as heck out. Don't use that bad word, right? And next week, we're going to fish with Miami Mutton Man. And we got some other stuff planned, so be sure to stay around. Yeah. I'm I sorry. just can't wait for these northeast winds to go away. It's relentless. You want to get offshore. We want to get offshore, too. It's been too. blowing and blowing and blowing. So. You can see all under. You can see it right now, it's still blowing. I don't know how much you can see that. Yeah. The wind probably just died when I turned the camera, but it's blowing like 15, 20 knots. Yep. All right, so we'll be back again with another episode tomorrow. So if you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And remember, those mean comments are no big deal to us. We really don't <laughs> care. I mean, it's actually just a joke for us. Um, anyways, so subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Until our next adventure, follow your dream and keep on catching.